Hello, and welcome back to what will likely be the last video for Project Warlock. We did it. We're at the end. We're at the end. I'm two points away from upgrading something. That's unfortunate. Oh, okay. Let's see here. Um, what did I do before? Oh yeah, okay. Yeah, yeah, okay. Ghost. You can move through monsters. That's actually pretty cool. I wish I would have had that earlier. Uh, no. no. Okay. Gives you extra fuel, dynamite. Rockets. Okay. I mean, that's not terrible, right? Shotgun x ray. your shells. I can see how that stuff becomes really useful, but I'm gonna do ghost actually. Get perk. There we go. Should have had that a long time ago. Um. Yes. And yes. Alright. I think we're ready for this. I don't know what it's gonna be, but we're gonna find out here. Hell. The Lord of Hell. The Lord of Hell. Alright. You know what time it is, right? It's time to get sight. The Lord of Hell. Oh boy. There he is. <clears throat> Uh-oh, what is he doing? <laughs> oh my god. Oops. Oh my god, go, 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 go. The health. My gun's still shooting at him. Whoa. Ah. Run, 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 run. Okay. Okay, that's out. Oh, 
my gun. Alright, let's pick the sucker up. Okay. Alright. Surprised they're not sending anybody else after me with this guy. Beat up here. die now. Any health back here? No, of course not. There's some. Oh my god. Nope, not enough. It's, I don't really have a whole lot here to go off of, do I? Yeah. 
I'm running out of stuff here pretty damn quick. Oh my god. Um... Oh, we can't go that way. Oh, there's some more magic right there. Come on, come on. Will this give it to me? No? How come I can't use any more magic? Why can I not use, uh... I gotta stop walking through that shit. Like, I have full magic. Let's see. So yeah, look at it. it lets me use that. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. Wow. No. It won't let me use my magic. That was so dumb. Why wouldn't it let me use my magic anymore? Alright, we're gonna use this sort of stuff first. Not that one. Uh, crossbow. Uh, 
Alright, let's do rockets. Oh, Jesus. That will be better for later. There we go. to use here, huh? I guess grenades? Now we can drop this down. Alright, let's use this opportunity to go around and get more ammo. I want to see if I can use this right now. Okay, I can. Okay. Alright. I can use it right now. It's supposed to be back here. I don't think I ever went back there before. Or more ammo at. for that. Okay. The 
think we're gonna get him this time. more magic. Got him. Oof. You've done it. The Lord of Hell himself, the scourge of life, has crumbled. His limp, bloody carcass bows before you. You've never felt so alive, so powerful. The walls of Hell are crumbling, revealing an army of hundreds of thousands of demons. Without a leader to follow, they bow to you. The only man powerful enough to kill the Lord of Hell. He was weak, unworthy, undeserving of the throne. You're more powerful than he was, and you haven't stopped growing in your ability. With a laugh and a gain, you ascend to the throne, finally understanding that evil can never truly be killed. Your strength courses through you. Now you intend on taking your bloodlust beyond this realm. The entire world awaits your wrath. All right, that's uplifting, Indy. All right, I'm gonna turn this down here for a second. Oh, I like it when they do fun credits. That's cool, you get to see all the enemies and what they're called. The Wraith. I really do love the, the variety of enemies this game had. Like, there are some games out there that do just simple palette swaps and stuff like that, but this game has so many unique things that you that you encounter and they, a lot of them have like different stages that they go through this is all the medieval enemies Oh yeah, that's right, you can get cut in half. That was the boss, I think, at the end of the medieval stage. It's funny to see him so tiny. Well, yeah, um, I'm uh, I'm pretty happy with the game. It's exactly what I wanted. It has that old school vibe to it, with a lot of like new design ideas, far more meat to its bones than like your standard Doom clones. Um, yeah, it, it, I think it's the perfect melding of old school and new school type of uh, design philosophies, and uh, like taking the, the pixel art stuff and um, and just like making it the best it could possibly be like this would have been a top tier game back in the 90s on the PC like it would have been hailed for its graphics uh, but it, I think a lot of it has to do with just the enemy design the level designs for the most part like at least the, the looks of them um, and uh, the animations are just also good. 
A lot of love and care went into this thing. This wasn't... I could just tell that this wasn't somebody just out to make a quick buck. You know? Like, they had... This was a kind of a passion project, is how I see it. I like little stuff like this also because it helps shows off helps show off the the work that people put into the game because in the heat of the moment you're just caring about killing these things uh, but having to actually be able to look at them and the work put into them makes you really appreciate the stuff the work put into it even more oh the sphinx I wasn't a huge fan of the industrial zone. Like, there was some cool stuff in there, but I think the level designs of that didn't really thrill me too much. I don't know. I <laughs> have the Terminators. See, I didn't even notice some of the details of the animation there before. I bet. <laughs> they must have had a lot of fun creating these things. I think we're back to the beginning, huh? Oh, they didn't show us the boss. Oh wait, maybe not. We'll let it keep going for a second here. I think we're in the hell creatures. Yeah, we are. Okay, never mind. <laughs> that thing. I love that thing. So gross. Is that it? Just stopped after that one. Oh, is that a bug? <laughs> I feel like it was supposed to continue going. Well, the music stopped, anyways. Okay. Well, let's continue. Uh. That's all you get there. Okay. Gallery episodes. Yeah, I don't think there's, um... Yeah. I mean, you can go back and play the stages, which is kind of cool. Right? Go back to, like, mummy stage. You get all these different things. That's pretty cool. Very cool. Alrighty. Well, uh, yeah. Uh, I fully endorse you playing this game. If you've been watching me this whole time, um, there's definitely a lot of ways you could tailor it to your own experience a bit with all the different settings and upgrades and shit you can do. Um, so, yeah. Um, uh, I think it just came out for consoles recently. Uh, high, high recommendation from me. Uh, good game. Good game. So... Thank you all for joining me through all this. I know it took a while, but, you know, 
I finished. There's that, right? Uh, yeah, and until the next game uh, that comes around, uh, take it easy. Bye.